six months or even less than six months they will start sending cars home to your own father's land turn you into a tenant peacefully oh, without fight no guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl here again peppy to all my new subscribers i see you guys thank you so much for subscribing to my oldies thank you guys for the great support and if you're just coming across my video for the first time or you're seeing my face for the first time please do well to subscribe and do not forget to turn on your bell notification button so that you can get notified whenever i upload new videos so guys welcome back to another video and on this video i'm going to tell you guys i will be telling you guys how you can be able to know who the Anambra man is. Like, how you can be able to detect an Anambra, Anambrarian when you see one, an Anambra man. Because we have so many states. We have Enugu state, we have Anambra state, we have Imo state, we have Ebonyo state. But the most of them, the, the, the menace of them, please, people should not come for me, are the Anambra men. And for you, like this if you want like if you want if you see an anambra man before even getting to talk to that person or to meet that person i will give you some hints on how to detect if that person is from anambra state so if this is something you like to watch and if this is something you enjoy please sit back relax and enjoy the you. video you see that man that will leave his father's land and come into your own father's land turn you into a tenant peacefully oh, without fight no drag drag no nothing that's an anambra, anambra man right there anambra men are so industrious that they will leave their own papa land and go into another person's father's land and then make you their tenants build invest in your father's land and turn you into a tenant and be collecting money on top of your land that is how industrious they are that's an anambra man for you anambra man eh is that man that will go to obodo Yibo overseas or europe anywhere just give him six months just six months or even less than six months they will start sending cars home <laughs> will go abroad you know some other people will go abroad years 10 years five years 20 years they've not achieved anything but another brahma will stay there for some months and they will start sending cars home and i see that's how you know an anam brahman that's a real anam brahman right there an anam brahman is that man that will get rich go down to his village when he gets to his village he will get all those young young boys take them back to the city train them in his business because they are always business minded train them in business settle them those boys will make money go back to their village pick another set of boys bring them to the city train them and settle them that's that's why anna wonder number obi as in funny joe for b they 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 transfer their wealth to get they love to like they'll go to their village and bring boys train them put them into business go settle them and then those ones will make money and keep that's an anambra man there are some kind of money anambra people made or anambra men made there are people tend to call them ritualists and all that an anambra man is not a ritualist he's just that man that will enter that place that they said nobody should enter you see any place that there is money and they said nobody should cross there if you enter there you are you're a goner and an umbra man because there is money there he will enter there and make that money irrespective of the dangers involved that's an anambra man right there he is ready to go there and take the risk you see all these um countries all these deadly like indonesia and all that you see all those um even china all those had had countries and all that south africa and i'm go there you will see a lot of anambra men there they go there they strive they try to make that money whichever way as long as it's not taking another person's life so whatever that could be they will enter there other people might be afraid to take that risk but an anambra man will 
find a more big atrego they will go there take that risk and come out and make that money which when they when they make millions of money people will say oh ogwego ritualists no they are just risk takers they go there make money they take that risk and make that money that always shock people an anambra man is that man that does not play with women in his life sister wives more uh, daughter they don't play with the women that they have in their life they always take good care of them always protect them so let me give you let me tell you guys something if you're dating an anambrahman or you know an anambrahman an anambrahman calls you ne ne be go do all mommy ne relax it's about to dash your money mm -hmm. an anambrahman loves jokes a lot we call it jackery okay if you're someone who does not take jokes just come up buddy if you go to all these their meetings or on meeting on or others they crack jokes a lot hanamata and jackery so this is an anambrahman for you he's a lover of jokes hanaman jackery too much so if your mouth is not sharp and you find yourself in the midst of anambra men <laughs> you always be a subject of laughter because they will use joke and finish you man trains his children with good morals like no matter how well he is he loves to impact good training in in his children especially the male both 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 male and female but especially the male children they they train you to be on your own they train you to have that zeal also to take care of yourself and to take care of your family probably when you grow up because they know that they will not always be there for you like they might get old and their own will just pass and they will transfer that strength irrespective of how how wealthy he is so you will see an anambra man a very wealthy business anambra man and 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 the son gets to a certain age 14 15 if he has an office or a shop where he sells something he will start taking you to that place like he tries to impact that strength in you knowing fully well that he he will not always be there so they try to make a path for their children that's an anambra man for you an anambra man is not a lazy man at all he toys day and night to make sure that he feeds his family to make sure that he puts food on his family on his family's table they toil day and night they do everything so that the children will not go through what they went through because some of them probably the ones that came out from not from a well-to-do families that struggled to make their money they they don't they don't waste money like that and anabra man is so calculative he always leaves something behind for the children so that the children will not go through what he went through in his life and anabra man is also that man that sees something where you see nothing you'll be like this you'll be looking at a very big forest and you're standing there with an anambra man an anambra man looking at that forest will be seeing a big mall a big market like this you will see a village girl <clears throat> a very timid village girl you'll be like mm, this one will not amount to anything an anambra man will be seeing a sales girl that's <laughs> that's how they are like where whatever you see nothing yes wherever you see nothing he sees something You'll be looking at shit like this. And Anna Brahman will be looking at Manu. That shit will tend to a Manu like this. He'll be there thinking of the next step. What is going to to, <coughs> to use these things to do. And he will surely do it. So wherever you see nothing, Anna Brahman, you see something. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, please click on the like button. Share if you can. Share to your family and your friends. And do not also forget to turn on your bell notification button so you can get notified whenever I upload new videos. And also do not forget, Peppy loves you all. Bye.